Hi everyone, thank you so much for joining me. My name is Jody, and my greatest wish is to share yoga with the world. So back in 2002, I took my first yoga class and I walked out of that class and I was filled with this almost indescribable, unbelievable feeling of happiness. And ever since then, I've been on the yogic path, learning as much as I can about the practice and sharing it with others. So I've decided to build a YouTube following. And right now we're doing a seven for seven yoga challenge. Do yoga every day for seven days with me for seven minutes. Today, we are going to do a core strengthening flow. So all of the yoga poses emanate out from a strong core. So it's really important important to improve our core strength. So today we're going to start by um, laying back. So go ahead and plant your feet and then just gently lay on to your back and then draw your knees into your chest. And give yourself a hug just for showing up. From here, release your arms out into T position. Enjoy a deep full inhale. As you exhale, send your bent knees to the right. Turn your head to the left. Inhale, lift your knees through center. Exhale, other side. Bent knees to the left, turn your head to the right. Inhale through center. Exhale, press your low back down and your toenails are gonna reach towards the earth in front of you. Inhale, lift up. Send your legs to 90 degrees. Curl your tailbone, lift your shoulders and pulse forward here for five, four, three, two, one. Exhale, release, arms back to T, bend your knees. This time, have your shins parallel to the earth. Take, enjoy a big inhale. Exhale, bent knees to the right, turn your head to the left. Inhale through center, exhale to the other side. Bent knees to the left, turn your head to the right. Inhale through center, exhale, press your low back down and then allow your toes to touch the earth in front of you. Inhale, lift up, send those legs to 90 degrees. Curl the tailbone, lift the shoulders, pulsing forward for five. Four, three, two, and one. Exhale, release. Bring your arms back into T position, but now keep your legs nice and straight. Keep your gaze tacked up towards the sky. And as you exhale, send your straight legs over towards your right. Inhale, lift through center. Exhale, straight legs to the left, keeping your shoulders rooting down into the earth. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, press your low back down and lower your legs down in front of you. Go as low as you can while keeping the low back pressing. Inhale, lift up. S curl the tailbone and pulse forward here for five, four, three, two, and one. Exhale, shoulders come back down. Another cycle like that. Straight legs go to the right, keeping your shoulders pressing into the earth. Inhale, lift up. Exhale to the other side. Straight legs go to the left as your gaze is up towards the sky. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, press the low back down. Straight legs lower towards the earth. Keep it pressing, keep it pressing. Inhale, lift up. And again, curl tailbone, lift shoulders, pulse for five. You can do it. Four, three, two, one, exhale, bend the knees, interlace your fingers with your pointer finger pointing forward, sending your bent knees over towards your left, pulse to the right for five, four, feel the burn, three, woo two, and one. Now hands on either side of the legs, pulse forward for five, four, three, two, and one. Last side, bent knees to the right, pulse to the left for five, four, Three, two, and one. Woo! Exhale, release. Hug your knees in and gently rock from side to side. From here, we're going to take upside down plank. So send your arms up towards the sky as if your hands could uh, touch the sky. Then without bending the elbows, draw the hands closer to your body or feel your shoulders go onto the earth. From here, lift your legs up to 90 degrees, and then we'll exhale into upside down plank. So lower your legs, but keep that low back pressing. This is upside down plank. Inhale, draw the knees in, send the legs up. Exhale, upside down plank. Pause here, feel how the hips and shoulders are in the same plane, that's a good thing. Inhale, draw the knees in and up. Exhale, lowering into upside down plank. Let's hold here. You might begin to shake. That's a good thing. You're growing stronger. You can do it. Stay for another big breath. And exhale, hug the knees in. Gently rocking 
from side to side. All right, we have, we'll do one more core strengthener. From here, take your arms alongside the body. Send your legs up to 90 degrees. As you exhale, pressing your low back down, lower your right leg. Lower as low as you can go without losing the press of the low back. Then inhale, lift the right leg. Exhale, lower the left leg. Keep that low back pressing. Inhale, lift. Exhale, lower righty. Low back presses and you're breathing. Inhale. Exhale, lower your left leg. And inhale, lift. This time we're going to hold. Exhale, lower your right leg and breathe here. Press that low back down even more and reach out through the soles of both feet. Enjoy one more breath. If you're shaking, you're growing stronger. And inhale, lift the right leg. Exhale, lower that left leg. Again, breathe here. Press the low back down even more. Reach out through both heels. You can do it. Stay for another breath. Feel the strength inside of you. And inhale, lift up and hug those knees in. Rock side to side. Great job. We will finish our practice today in Shavasana. So send the legs long, allow the feet to sort of fall out to the side, allow the back of your hands to rest on the earth and close your eyes. See if you can completely surrender in Shavasana, letting go a little bit more today to open yourself up to receive more joy, more peace, more harmony inside of you. Stay here as long as you can today. We're gonna to gently come out by sending our arms overhead, bending one knee and the other, sliding the feet close to our body. We'll roll onto our right side, and then we'll slowly press ourselves up. Thank you so much for joining me for the 7 for 7 Yoga Challenge. Make sure that you subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends. We'll see you tomorrow.